Hey, what's up guys? I know it's uh, been almost a month since I uploaded my last video. Uh, I started this channel to, uh, to document my weight loss journey. I was wanting to lose a uh, hundred pounds. Well, you know, this past month, uh, I've been sick. I thought it was a cold, but it was allergies. And, um, uh, instead of losing weight, I've gained four pounds. And, uh, you know, besides, besides that, I really, I, I just couldn't talk without just, you know, I couldn't breathe and I would just get vapor locked or go into a coughing fit, you know. So I've just had to let this run its course and I, I think I've just almost got it kicked now. I'm still having to take uh, some medications and some nasal sprays. You know, the 1st of August, I really had my diet dialed in and I was so happy and so excited about it. Uh, you know, and, and this was kind of at the beginning of the chopple craze when it really took off. And I, and I found out that I could have chopples every day. I like having eggs every day in some way, shape, or form anyway. And I could have chopples every day and still lose weight. And like I said, the, the 1st of August, you know, it was slow, but I was losing a little bit every day. And I was eating uh, 1,300, 1,400 calories a day. Um... August 13th, I hit a new low weight of uh, 51 pounds lost, um, and that was uh, 186.0 pounds, and uh, I did one day get a little glimpse of 185.8, uh, so anyway, I, I, was, I was in that rhythm, and uh, I thought... I'm not going to do anything, you know, sometimes it's in your control and sometimes, it, you know, like getting sick, that was out of my control, but sometimes it's within my control, you know, I will think that I'm, uh, I'm strong enough that I can uh, bring some walnuts in the house or I can have a few blueberries or strawberries and I can control myself and, uh, you know, I just, uh, I thought I'm in such a good rhythm. Uh, I'm not going to, I'm not going to have anything off plan. I'm just going to stick with what I'm doing and continue losing weight. And, uh, you know, and then I got sick. So, you know, so much for being in control. But, uh, you know, I know that, uh, for, well, for anybody that doesn't know me, uh, I'm pre-diabetic, but I no longer have to take any medications uh, since I started keto. And... And, you know, I, so I still check my blood sugars every morning, fasting, first thing in the mornings. And when I'm losing weight, my blood sugar range is 70 to 85, 75, 85, somewhere, somewhere in that range. And I will be steadily losing weight. Well, when I got sick, my blood sugar shot up to uh, 102, 110, 114, 107, you know, just, just every morning. That, that's just how it was. Last Sunday through Tuesday, I decided to do a fast and see if I could drive down those uh, blood sugars. You know, and I, and I know if my blood sugar is high, my insulin is high, and I'm just not going to lose weight. So I did that fast, and that was the longest fast that I've been able to complete, which was 60 hours. And it took like 48 hours fasting to get my blood sugars down to um, uh, even 90. And then at 60 hours fasting, my blood sugars were uh, at 85, which I did let go of some water weight then. So I have lost part of the water weight. And I think this week, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not just fasting to, to lose weight. I, I'm hoping it's going to uh, help clear up this uh, inflammation and uh, help put an end to this, you know, allergies. Or, you know, I, I'm sure it's allergies. I'm highly allergic to grass and uh, ragweed. And, uh, you know, ragweed pollen is high this time of the year in, uh, uh, in Tennessee. Uh, so that's what, that's the plan this week. I'm just going to do some more, uh, longer fast, um, just whenever I can work it in. Um, it isn't working for me today, but, uh, hopefully tomorrow, maybe I can do at least a, a 36 hour fast, uh, until Thursday. So anyway, um. Uh, that's where I am, guys, and, you know, I just wanted to say that, you know, these things are going to happen, you know, throughout life. I'm not going to, like, throw my hands up and say, oh, well, it's not working. You know, you know I'm going to go back to 
bread, biscuits, cookies, or, you know, I'm, I'm not doing anything like that, I, you know, uh, I'm just uh, keeping it keto and uh, throwing some fasting in there and uh, just wait until my blood sugars come down and I start losing weight again. So, anyway, that's what's going on with me, and I will uh, see y'all next time. Bye.